Okay, everyone. So now we are discussing the difference between implicit type conversion and the explicit type conversion. So we have learned that implicit type conversion is done by the compiler. Means we have we don't have to write anything. Compiler will automatically done this. And if I talk about explicit, it is done by the user. Me means we have to write the code for that. It is the automatic type conversion. because there is no involvement of user it avoid loss of data there is approximate no loss of data because if i say that the integer value is 10 and we are converting that value to float so it is 10.00 so there is no loss of data but here it can be the loss of data can be the loss of data means if we are converting 10.3 float value to integer value it will convert from 10.3 to 10 so this 0.3 is lost now that's why data may loss and may loss is one more point because if i convert 10.00 to 10 then there is no loss of data again the float is converted to integer so that's why may is mentioned it is not strictly loss of data here we are converting the lower data type to higher data type because int is the lower data type and float is the higher data type and similarly if i talk about the explicit it convert from higher to lower just like 10.3 is the float which is higher and 10 is the lower that is the integer so that is the difference between implicit and explicit type conversion and one more thing you can see that while converting from int to float we have not mentioned anything but while converting from float to int we have mentioned one int in the bracket means explicitly user is forcing you to convert to integer so that is the difference between implicit and explicit type conversion